Last week, we forgot to show you these adorable white wallabies, which are unique to Bruni Island. Now, on with the show. We're off bright and early on the next leg of our tour, and this one's to Port Arthur. We keep upgrading on our buses. It's really nice. It's true. <laughs> our partner over here is putting on makeup, or I'd flash the camera at her, but I don't want to be killed this early in the morning. <laughs> We are wandering about in historic Richmond. Thankfully we have some beautiful weather this morning, so we're gonna hope that holds. That's jail, not gowl. I learned that the hard way. These are beautiful. I've never seen leaves like these. The beautiful little path by the river right here in Richmond. That thing right there is, I don't remember, but the kids call it a turbo chuck, a turbo chicken. That bridge was built in 1823. It's the oldest bridge in Tasmania. Absolutely gorgeous. This is St. John's, the oldest Catholic church in all of Australia. That's Pirate's Bay, though there's no record of pirates here. Tasmania is cold, but it is gorgeous. Check out this clamshell. It, it looks fake. Oh, made in China. I'm just kidding. <laughs> this is Eagle Hawk Neck. It's a very narrow piece of land that the British used to have, like 21 soldiers and 18 vicious dogs, to keep the convicts to the south if they escaped from Port Arthur Prison. This thing we're about to go into is called the Separate Prison. It's where they put the Prisoners that wouldn't follow orders and work and behave and stuff. They sat alone for 23 hours a day, weren't able to make any sound, and whenever they were taken out of their cell, they had a black hood placed over their head. And if they were really bad, they went into the dark cell with three foot thick walls, no sound, no light, and it said it took them about two days average to go crazy in there. Fun times. Now we head to the punishment cell, the ultimate in solitary confinement. In the dark cell, when you get in there and it's completely silent, your ears, it feels like your ears or your head is swelling. And the only way that I did this was I was listening to my breath go in and out and then it was fine. But oh my goodness, and that was only, what? 30 seconds. It's so pretty now. I don't envision it was if you got sitting here in the 1800s. <laughs> Out here is where the children's prison was. was the site of the April 28th, 1996 massacre in Port Arthur that led to some rather large changes in Australia. This is the Tasman Arch. It is awesome. And here we are at Devil's Kitchen. This place is insane. So much amazing stuff around Tasmania. The views are epic. And okay, it's that work. Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good.